What is going on you guys? Theo here with the big review back yet again with another King of Fighters all-star video and today is the big day. It is the 800 sub special. We are going to be whaling for the first time in this channel's history so don't get used to it. On the SS banner we're going to go to pity on both the fighters and on the cards one time each and say sayonara adieu goodbye to this banner officially after we are done. So what we have currently is we have Mai and Athena at Awakening Level 3 apiece. We have an extra Athena memory. We have two copies of the Athena finisher. So that's what we got. We do have one pity ticket laying around that I have not used from the first time I went through it on stream for the cards. And we are going to save that obviously so that we can see what we get for the card banner today before we make those decisions. Basically what we want to walk away with today to consider this a win is we want at least one Athena so we can get our current Athena up to Awakening level 4 and we want one Mai minimum so that we can use the Pity on Mai to get her to Awakening level 4. We have red but no no dice. Um, but on cards which is really the bigger focus right now fighters to me are secondary because I wanted them at minimum at Awakening level 3 so I'm kind of happy with where they're at for the most part but I want to get the cards I need to at least get the set because I want to use it on Athena, I want to run tests, I want to bring you guys that info so that you guys know what you should be doing on these banners as far as the cards go especially because I feel like the characters everybody pretty much knows what they need to be doing there. But I want to get that card set so I can bring you guys footage and tests before these banners are gone so you guys know if it's worth further investment into it. And then from there, basically what we're going to hope for on the cards is we're going to hope to at least get two pieces before we get to the pity ticket so that we can use one pity ticket for the third part. And then I can use the current one on the option card for my because that is a phenomenal guild raid card and I really, really need at least one copy. But yeah, so... We've uh, pretty much started on our fighter summons here and been getting nothing, so now that we pretty much know the game plan, you guys can uh, watch me have a meltdown as I go through these because it's much different, I can officially say, because I've never really done this before. I've in the past picked up like little packages and things, but I've never actually gone like all out like this. And I don't mind doing it whatsoever. This is, in my opinion, an investment into you guys, the community, and the channel. This is one of those things where, to me, it's definitely worth it. But at the same time, I definitely don't want it to be a waste. So <laughs> we'll hope that the game plan works out. But so far, not looking so good. We are getting nothing but red borders, which is, uh, yeah, that's, that's a thing. I've heard a lot of people complain about the rates on these, and to be honest with you guys, after seeing so many multi-pulls on Saturday on stream, as we get another dead multi, I believe that was our last current token, but yeah, so basically on stream i had witnessed some some beats but at the same time it seemed like most people were doing pretty darn well so oh now we get into the cards by the way which is going to be cursed i'm sure as a result of if, if at last oh i was about to say if saturday was anything to go on but never mind we got one piece coming up and it's definitely a new piece because we don't have any so this is off to a great start the fighters weren't great but there we go there's one piece is that a type one? I believe that's type one. Not sure. But we at least got one now, guys. So we are uh, starting out pretty strong on the cards. So let's hope that our luck continues. But overall, from what I'd noticed on stream, I would say that the rates are the rates pretty much the way. Oh, wow. Speaking of rates, that's two in a row. <laughs> now watch it be the exact same one we already pulled. No, it's not. Guys. I think, yeah, we're, we have one pity laying around, we'll get one pity from this. Yeah, we are guaranteed now to have the set. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, that was anticlimactic. I was expecting that to take a lot more stressing. Wow, okay, uh, cool. So we're, we officially have the set. Mission accomplished, right? <laughs> <laughs> now we just hope that we get my finisher or an option and we're in great shape. But speaking of my finisher, I'm not overly worried about it. I'm going to do a video on a couple of little like details and things about these guys here in the coming days because there's going to be plenty of content coming with the for the SS characters rather, but uh the my finisher is not 
necessary, I would say. She already has a 3PG that is going to have a secondary effect on it as well, and also it does not miss in Guild Raid, really, so it's one of those things where if you don't get it, it's not the end of the world type of situation, so if I don't end up with it, Put it this way, I have two pity tickets coming to me here. I'm going to use one definitely on the third piece for this Athena set unless I pull it, and then the other one's probably going towards the Mai option. If I Even if I don't get the Mai finisher, I'm definitely going to use it on the Mai option because for Guild Raid content, that card is slowly becoming one of the best cards for Guild Raid. Specifically, if you want to have very, very high damage runs in a single key. So I definitely need that card minimum one so that's that's the priority at this point with my like i said you don't necessarily need the finisher in order to get the full extent out of her because again she already has a 3pg so we're not too stressed out about that if we don't get it however it would be nice so <laughs> let's hope but that's going to be the uh first batch of tokens there we have, I believe, I don't think we have enough diamonds necessarily to do much of anything with yet, so we're not going to worry about those. However, we do have a few tickets, I believe. Let's see, I want to make sure which of the cards I got here, just so that I know where I'm at. I believe it's type 1 and type 2, though, is the ones that I've got. I need type 3. Yeah, type 1 and type 2. So we have type 1, we have type 2 now. We need type 3. Okay, I believe we might have, let me see here, yeah, we have enough for one, so we'll do this real quick, and then I'm going to have to pause for a brief whale intermission as I uh, pick up the last purchase that I will need to finish this off. Okay, well, that's, that's not good. That's not something we needed. I think that that's pretty much all we have in there. All right, so, all right, guys, well, you enjoy this brief interlude, and I will be right back. All right, and I'm back. Hope you guys enjoyed that as you uh, watched me in my natural habitat, or unnatural habitat, I suppose, as it were, considering where we're at currently, but yeah. So it's kind of interesting viewing the game from this lens and doing it this way, because I've never, like I said, I've never done this to this extent. I've always picked up, you know, little packages here, little packages there, but definitely... You feel more pressure when you're this invested, right? Like, this must be how whales feel. Has to be. But <laughs> I, it's one of those things, though, where with this thing, I feel like the SS banner had decent decent packages if you're a whale. Like, if you're somebody that was whaling, you could pretty much get an entire pity rotation for the price it used to... Oh, there we go. Finally. Finally. All right, so... It's got to at least at least be Athena or my. Okay. All right. Well, my Athena luck continues, but now we can awakening level for her. So now it's pre the pressure's on for us to get at least one my guys. So far, if we can get one more my on these ten tokens, one more my basically makes this a win. This is everything we wanted if we get one more my before we get to pity. So oh, we got a fess. Okay. Please be my. Please be my. Please be my. Yeah, like I said, if we get one more my, we're going to pity. We'll have two my's at that point, which means we can get her to awakening. Oh my god! No! I am so tired of you. I pulled her on stream also. I hate off banner fest pulls in general, but that one is like a giant kick in the face. I swear. I'm so sick of it. I've pulled her three times. Every single time I've pulled her, I believe has been as a spoiler on a banner. So, yeah. I'm not even going to awaken her. At this point, I'm personally offended by her. I'm going to fodder all of her memories. <laughs> just, just saying. We are becoming mortal enemies at this point. But hopefully that didn't just uh, ruin my chances. But yeah, so we need one more Mai, which tends to be the story of our life with this banner. That was the way it was on Saturday. We were just sitting there going, one more Mai, one more Mai. It's just, it seems like Athena and I, we have a bit of a relationship in this game. We have kind of a, we kind of have kind of a thing between each other where she has this understanding that if I'm summoning, she has to show up. 
which is fine, as we have another dead multi here. But at the same time, too much of anything is a bad thing, right? Right? Right. Anyway, so hopefully here, I think we have, is this number four on this rotation of token? Oh, okay, we have a fess. Okay. Be my. Please be my. Just make my life easier. Just, just give me the my, and we can consider this whole summoning session a win. Yes! Finally! Woo! Awesome, you guys. So we got her. Awakening level four on Athena and my. We'll finish this up. All we got to do is finish our card pulls. We got exactly what we wanted. Awesome. Guys. Awesome. <laughs> Oh man, I am, this is the point in the video where I'm at a loss for words on, oh man, that was, that was a lot less stressful than I thought it would be. I was really figuring this would go down to the wire. I guess technically it did, what, we had like four tokens left at that point or something? Four more multis on this, but cool, so use this last one, we'll get the pity, we'll use it on my. After this, though, we're going to finish up our cards. Hopefully our card pulls finish as strongly as this did. But yeah, guys, we got everything we wanted here. This is a very successful 800 sub celebration video, I would say. Cool. Okay, so just do the cards now, I guess. Yeah, I guess we'll just finish up these cards. All right, well, here goes nothing. I mean, if we could get the, the my, either the option or the finisher here, then we're frozen? Oh, okay. Then we're we're golden. But even if we do not, like I said, we have the pity coming up. We have one pity laying around. We're good. So at this point, I'm just I'm sitting back and relaxing. I'm not even stressing out over this. So what this basically means now, guys, is I'm going to be able to bring you guys a ton of footage in the next week. So if any of you would like to use that as kind of reference material on what you should be doing with the cards specifically, because I feel like, again, the fighters are pretty straightforward for everybody. If you're trying to decide to whether you know you want to save rubies on the cards and just only go to one pity or not go in at all, or whatever the case may be, then, oh, okay. You watch, it'll be another Athena finisher, and I'm going to be sad. Please don't be another Athena finisher. You know, is this the new K finisher for me? Like, is it just going to start stalking me? Luckily, after this banner goes away, I can I never have to worry about pulling it again. But at the same time, really, Athena? Really? <laughs> but yeah, so anyway, back to what I was saying. We are going to be bringing you guys probably DPS comparisons and so on with the new Athena set here in the next day or so. I'll probably prioritize that video unless there's some big news that I need to be covering or what have you. And then we will also go into kind of some character reviews and things like that at some point this week as well, but those take time to put together. So everything should end up hopefully one of these turns no uh so we should be able to bring you guys quite a bit of good information on these characters over the course of the next week so stay tuned for all that but this video was for you guys this was just a thank you to all of you for getting me to 800 plus subs i've only been doing this since the beginning of december and at this point i could have never guessed that this channel would be what it is today we've now been doing this not even three months and we're at 800 plus subs and we have just been, things have been phenomenal. And if I could have any parting words whatsoever in this video, as we pretty much finish this card banner up here, we'll use our pities and then we will be done for the day. But if I could say anything, it's just thank you guys, because you have no idea how much it means to me to be at this point. And there will be big changes and big updates to the channel in the coming months. I'm working on a game plan currently with those things, and hopefully you guys enjoy that stuff. I would like to run a lot of it by you guys as well, since I do consider this a community. And so it's one of those things where I would like to get your input, but let's get our Mai here. That way we can get her to Awakening Level 4. Hey girl, hey. I love her design. I love her design for this model. She looks great. I like that she has her back turned. So she's kind of got that like cheeky thing going on and not in that way, okay? She's mostly covered down. No, stop, stop, stop it. I see where your head's going, just stop it. 
I, I just, I like, really like her design. Something about her design this time around is very my, as weird as that sounds. The other Mai's do nothing for me. They just, they're whatever. But I definitely like the character model that they went with for the, for her art here. So anyway, let's pick up. I think we just need to get our option and we're good. So that's the video guys, major success. Thank you all so much for watching today. Like, share, and subscribe for more daily King of Fighters All-Star content. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Continue.